A solution that provides us with a robust and consistent control of botrytis as well as powdery mildew. Powerful disease control and that protects yield. That would let me spray earlier and give me the same control that I have today or even better. It would also make Fusarium one less thing to worry about. Un producto de control de todas las enfermedades de fin de ciclo por un mes o más sería perfecto. Ek hi product hamari jo hai 6-7 bimariyon pe kaam kare aur lagat hamari jo hai kam ho jaye. So adepidine uh, is a new molecule. Uh, when I saw adepidine for the first time in 2011, I was amazed to see the broad spectrum activity, but also the difficult disease to combat by conventional solutions. So in that way, adepidine brings progress to uh, the carboxamide family. So the first compounds were put in the market in 1966, and for a long time, the industry thought that there was no potential for broad spectrum. We have already two other very good compounds and we then have seen we have another one which is even better and has more opportunities than this. Of course, the team was very proud of having this. This is the only pyrazole carboxamide which is derived from an aliphatic amine and having in addition an N-metoxy group, which is absolutely novel. And we had good arguments from the past that we could come through with a new box in, in the FRAC classification system. And I think now with Isodem, Solatanol and Adabidine, I think the competition uh, has a very tough life in future. We're very surprised to see the outstanding rain fastness of Adabidine. Uh, we've not seen anything like that from any other product from the market in the last 30 years. But above all, the most exciting thing for me is the amount of adepidine which will stick onto a whole range of different crop surfaces, whether they're easily wettable or difficult to wet, and its surface tenacity under rain is just simply outstanding. It meters itself into the wax on the surface of the leaf, moves slowly into the leaf over time. It moves within the xylem with water flow within the leaf, and it's always in the right place all the time to give us disease control. Adepidin is, is surprising because it's, it is ex so extremely active, and it's active on a whole range of different uh, succinate dehydrogenase enzymes. We compared the intrinsic potency of adepidin to a range of different commercial SDHIs, and in each case, we were able to show that adepidin has the highest intrinsic potency of all of these compounds against the target enzyme. Adepidin would be a new mode of action for uh, Fusarium head blight. It's a very difficult pathogen to control. So, so yes, it's a real game changer. It's unique in the sense that it is very powerful. Uh, I would say, from what I've seen in the greenhouse, it is the most powerful SDHI on certain diseases like septoria or net blotch. It's just much more potent. It will also be a product of choice. If I compare to other fungicides which are currently used, this is something really special. With the Dapidin, we have seen very high levels of disease control. We have done lab trials where we saw very good inhibition of the fungal spore germination, the growth, but that translated very well into greenhouse activity. And then when we did the field testing, the performance also was very well in the fields. Vegetable grower grows normally very different crops, many crops, so having one compound that covers a wide spectrum of diseases is very useful for him. Adepidine is clearly a step change level of activity against leaf spots, but also a very good activity against powdery mildew and difficult to control diseases, such as botrytis, white moles, but also target spot on soya bean and fusarium head blight. Adepidine has been tested in many different countries on different crops, from corn, soya bean, cereals, to vegetable specialty crops. It's a product which is applied at a low use rate, meaning protection also of uh, the environment. We can also uh, envisage, for example, aerial application because low rate, low volumes, quite concentrated formulations, so you can apply it via aerial uh, sprays. 
The crops to be retreated are very broad. Um, this is a very versatile compound. And on the other side, of course, uh, because of this versatility, it's also to be retreated in almost all countries around the globe. It has a, has a good safety profile for the user, for the consumer, and also for the environment. Powerful simplicity to me means that we've got a molecule that's going to be very easy for growers to use. It's got no significant loss mechanisms. It's got this great rain fastness. It's stable within the plant. There's nothing out there at the moment that will do the same job as a deputin can do. It's a big difference. So it's going to be, you see it once and you will use it. A deputin will be a key tool for farmers, especially in conditions where they have to rely on a solid, robust and sustainable product.